as I'm sure you can already tell, I'm back. Uh, I'm back in London. I have left the jungle in Australia, which is where I was uh, before this. To be honest, I just want to start off with that. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm just really, really sorry. Uh, I'm sure a lot of you and most of you have seen uh, that a lot of stuff has been written in the press over the last uh, over the last few days. I thought the least you deserved was for me to come home and just talk and just sit down and talk to you and explain everything that has been going on. I'm so sorry to anyone that I offended, anyone I upset, anyone I made feel uncomfortable. Now, like a lot of you growing up, I was all over social media. My entire life is on social media. I've grown uh, I, an amazing through that, social media has led to being my job. It's my entire mm -hmm. job. That, like, mm -hmm. My work is this online and everything that comes with it. And I've messed up. I've messed up. I've been really stupid. Some bad things, some horrible things, some pretty disgusting things that I'm, I'm just like, I'm just ashamed of. I'm just straight up ashamed of. This is such a hard video. I've never want. I've never. I don't want. Like, I've never wanted to have to make anything like this. I've never wanted to feel like I've let you guys down so much. Just something so like careless and and inconsiderate to other people. I was young. I was. I was stupid. I was careless. I just wasn't thinking. At this point, this was. This was back when I. I was in school. I just left school, and I. I didn't know what I was doing. I was getting into arguments with people on Twitter. I had any kind of following before I knew I'd ever have any kind of impact online. I was just, I was just stupid. I said some really inconsiderate things. It's hard. It's growing up is is hard. All I can do is just beg and encourage that you guys don't make the same mistake as well. Don't ever put anything online that you like wouldn't say. I heard someone say, don't ever write anything online that you wouldn't write on a T-shirt. I didn't think. I just didn't think about that when I was younger. And I just said some very careless, horrible things. I, like I said, I found it it's like a horrible, horrible feeling the way that this has all happened. Since like, I was 16, obviously, as you can imagine, like, I was a kid. I've done so much growing up since then. Like, a lot has changed. My entire life, my entire world has changed. Like, as I know it, like I said, I didn't, I had nothing back then. I wasn't doing anything. I was just young excuse that's not an excuse whatsoever and the thing is i still am growing up every single day <laughs> in fact i'm growing up a bit more today today is my birthday i've got i've grown up a whole year i'm now 23 because since then i've done everything i can to have a positive impact on your life and not a negative thing and, and not make you think that these things are okay that, that that's one thing that i do love about social media you know it's not it's not polished our entire life is on there and I do everything I can to show you guys my entire life and let you win on my entire life and take you all on this crazy journey. I'm, I'm just so gutted and I, I, I'm embarrassed. I'm so embarrassed that all of this has happened now because much and I, because I feel, I don't know, why one of the reasons I went on the show is because it wasn't because I just wanted to keep on growing. I just saw it as, an, uh, as another achievement and a huge achievement to see off the year. I just feel like I completely, uh, completely messed it up, really. You constantly have my back. Like, the, there's, there's one of you is just so overwhelming. So I just want to thank you all for that. And, um, so, yeah, I'll hopefully see you guys very soon.